Hey guys, welcome to another pre-calculus math lesson. Uh, so before we start um, calculus, we also need to understand um, another concept called uh, rate of change. And basically, um, if you remember, uh, in linear equations, we talked about the concept gradient. Now, the term gradient obviously refers to the slope of the line, slope of the straight, of the line in general. And it's also the same thing as, um, well, we gave it a symbol M, all right, the gradient, which is the slope of the line, which is also the same thing as um, change in y over change in x or you can say it's rise over run between two points or you can say it's y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 so these are all concepts that we have talked about previously um, just from the linear equations tutorials. So if you're not familiar with all of these concepts, you probably need to go through the algebra or linear equations tutorials again so you know what I'm talking about. Um, so let's start with uh, a simple straight line equation such as y equals 2x and if you draw this equation in GeoGebra, so I'm just going to plot the graph y equals 2x, you get a straight line. And you'll see that the whole line has the same slope. So this line here has a constant, constant, constant slope. Right, the slope of the line does not change. So what that means is it has the same gradient um, at any point on the line. Right, so how do you find the gradient between two points? Well, if you select two points, if we select two points on the graph on the line so let's say when x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2 so if you have a look at the line um, let's just put a point there um, so we can move this point around when x is equal to 1 y is equal to 2 as stated here and let's try when x is equal to 3 when x is equal to 3 y is equal to 6 as you can see at the location of this point so when x is equal to 3 y is equal to 6 and the rate of change or the gradient Um, which is, sorry, I should have said that the rate of change is pretty much the same thing as gradient. So the rate of change of y with respect to x. Right, rate of change of y with respect to x is pretty much the same thing as gradient. Right, so it's saying that how fast does the y value change with respect to x so it's changing y over change in x which is y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1 so I'm gonna let the second point here be x2 and y2 the first point be x1 and y1 so it's 6 minus 2 over 3 minus 1 so it's 4 over 2 which is 2 right so the gradient 
of um, this line is equal to 2 at any point sorry any two points on the line right so you can pick any two points you want you can pick um, for example I'm gonna zoom out you can pick when X is equal to 10 and Y is equal to 20 you can let that be your x1 y1 and let when x is equal to let's say uh, 20 and y is equal to 40 let that be your second point it doesn't matter which two points you pick you'll get the same gradient now unfortunately it's not that simple when we get to a quadratic equation 